We did it! Ah, I have something in my ear. <laughs> <laughs> After 137 days of searching, we found the motorhome of our dreams. Uh, more specifically, a motorhome that I don't think we're gonna lose our shirt on. Floor plan, features, brand, didn't None care about any of that. We just wanted to lose the least amount of money possible, which is very difficult to do in the RV market. We decided to go for an older luxury model versus getting a newer entry level model. So we bought a 1999 Monaco Dynasty. Let's give you a quick tour. This is the couch that we're gonna keep. It's got seat belts so we can buckle in Hudson's car Actually, seat. I'm not sure if we're gonna keep it. I may replace that, but the seat belts will stay for Hudson. We're gonna have seat belts. This one's gonna go and we're going to put in probably some sort of a desk crib combo that Mike's gonna work on a design for. We have got a kitchen table. We have got the kitchen sink, the stove top, microwave, all very exciting. Aqua hot, diesel powered, unlimited and instant hot water here. Refrigerator, freezer, and a nice maker. Full size shower. Washer dryer combo for cloth diapers. Automatic footrest for while Mike's driving, so I can sit here. <laughs> Solar panels. Head sliders. Outdoor shower. Generator on sliders. 10,000 pound hitch for a mobile wood chop. In 2014, it got a new roof, new solar panels, new batteries, new awnings, new tires, and a full service. When we got it, there was four known problems, which is why we got it so cheap. The right turn signal cover on this was missing, and the previous owners hunted high and low and could not find a replacement. I did the same, and they no longer make it. Salvage yards had none to be found, but I did some digging and found out that this is actually the same signal as an early 90s Ford Bronco. So I found it on eBay, 37 bucks. There's a crack in the passenger window, which is unfortunate because these were just replaced in 2014. To get it repaired or replaced is going to be $1,000. I bought a kit for do-it-yourself windshield repairs for $85 on Amazon. I'm going to see how that works out. So this is the main thing that I have to fix, and it's a biggie, is the floor rotted out underneath the refrigerator because there was a leak at some point. They fixed the leak and they inspected it and there is no mold, but what I'm thinking I'll have to do is tear all of this flooring out and we'll start here and do all hardwood floors all the way up through the front. So we'll get rid of the carpet in the front, get rid of the tile here. It'll go really nice hardwood floors, then tile in the bathroom, and then carpet in the bedroom. So this is it, it's our new home on wheels. We're very excited, happy with everything that we've purchased so far. We're excited. Look forward to some videos of me fixing this thing up as we go along, doing all the repairs, doing all the customization, and then we're ready to hit the road. We'll probably do a few short test trips to test all the systems. We're gonna have to wait just a week or two for those videos because we're actually working on a personal finance basics Udemy course, which is going to be 60 videos on our part that we've been working on. Uh, so we're a little swamped right now and it's killing me not to be able to come out here every single day and just work on this thing But I got to finish these videos We've also got our two birth experience videos posting right after this one So look out for those and then we'll see you next week. Bye guys